Hey there, friends. Thanks for checking in. Chacho 2023 at the SAR USA Showplace. A lot of excitement going on here because they have three new handguns that will be available to purchase. And they kept it budget friendly, but they made some improvements as well as some other firearms that I think people are really going to enjoy. Let's start here. The SAR 9 has grown in popularity in the last couple years, probably I'd say three years, it's really grown. I have it, I love it, but now they have the SAR 9 SOCOM. Check this out. This will be available for under 600 bucks. And what they did was they took the SAR 9 to a whole new level. Initially, you notice the slide cuts on both sides there. It looks super cool. It will have a 17 round mag right here, as well as two 21 round mags a four and a half inch threaded barrel, night sights, and a flared magwell. One of the things people love with the SAR-9 is the trigger. They say it's like a, a combination between a Glock and an HK. This, they did a phenomenal job with the Gen 3 trigger. Made a little bit lighter, a little bit more crisp. And that short reset that is very nice. Still has the pick rail right there. The SAR-9 SOCOM offers a different color change and all those features for under 600 bucks. Can't wait to get my hands on this. The ergos on this just feel so nice. I, I often said that, you know, kind of has that HK feel. I think they have some of the best ergos in the market and SAR USA added it to the SAR-9 as well as the SAR-9 SOCOM. Love the way it looks and that's going to be a shooter another one that people were really excited about it made it out in print and it's not until now where it's going to become available in the next couple months and that is the sar 9 subcompact initially you look at this it looks like a springfield hellcat but it's not it's a sar 9 so basically they took the sar 9 and shrunk it down it has a 3.3 inch barrel and it comes with two 12 round 9 millimeter magazines a 15 round mag will also be available we can see forward serrations and standard three dot night sights kind of looks green fiber optic they stand out a lot if you put this in low light conditions it would really stand out that i've, I've had firearms with that type of sight system on there it's really nice 3.3 inch barrel and it has the gen 3 trigger that i talked about with the socom model and that's what we're looking at. People love the SAR trigger. You're going to love the Gen 3 and check out that reset. People looking for CCW options. They, they love the double stack 9 mil subcompact. And now SAR USA has it with the SAR 9 SC. This will be available for under 500 bucks with the two 12 round mags. And I know that's certainly going to make a lot of people happy. Keeping it budget friendly. So... The one thing that is also super exciting is the new revolver line. It's not actually new. Sarsal Mass has, has made revolvers. Other people have told me that, but they've never made their way to the U.S. until now. Here we have a SAR revolver. This has a four inch barrel. It's a six shot 357 Magnum that is really nice. You can see it has the rubber grips there. It has uh, adjustable rear sight, ramped up front sight, four inch barrels, so also be available with a six inch barrel, full under lug, Cerakoted crane and ejector, under 700 bucks for this beauty. Double action revolver, and that single action, very nice. So I'm looking forward to that. That's the one missing piece in my revolver collection is that midsize. You know, I've got the Python, I've got the, the pocket ones i've got the 357 and others this is really nice so i'm going to take a good hard look at this as well sorry usa get it done at shot show there's a lot of excitement at this booth people are all over the place they, even now i'm in a back room and i can hear slides racking and triggers pulling people are excited and, and i think these three are, are causing a lot of that excitement as well as the reputation they have built for themselves in a, in a worthy one. I've got the P8L, love that. It's like a CZ uh, SP01 copy and the SAR-9. Can't wait to get my hands on some of these and show you guys these at the range. If you like videos like this, please subscribe and share. I always appreciate the thumbs up button. Thanks for watching and you guys be safe.